Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. If there's one thing today that really surprised me greatly was the news that Miss Gina Lopez, a philanthropist and at the same time a Filipina environmentalist had passed away at the very young age of 65. This is indeed such a sad news for us from the Philippines because we have lost one advocate of the environment and someone who cares so much for the welfare of people especially the children and of course other fellow filipinos uh i was reading online at the new york times and gina lopez uh was uh, was uh, said to have died because of multiple organ failure and this was also confirmed by the ABS-CBN Foundation, a social development group of which she was a long-time chairman of. Okay, the if there's one thing that really impacted me is that, of course, if I, as uh, one of the Filipinas who more or less got affected with uh, the news, I believe, and I'm sending also my condolences as well as sympathy and prayers to the family, friends of uh, Miss Gina Lopez, who I believe is mourning because of the loss, early loss of a great a family member a mentor and also an inspiration again a condolences to everyone and at the same time sending my sympathy as well now as we pay tribute to miss gina lopez one thing i can say she had been a great example not only to uh, filipinos but especially to filipinas that if you have a dream pursue it if you want to reach for your goal do it uh, there should be nothing stopping you to do that. She did. She was a woman full of courage, full of strength, and at the same time, uh, she was full of a uh, positive uh, attitude and spirit, as you can see from the accomplishment that she had done. And there is like a part here in the New York Times article that they have shared that really inspired me, and I didn't know this before. Uh, they said during the time that Ms. Gina Lopez who was an environmental uh, secretary uh, there was an issue regarding mining where she had to stop 41 mining companies uh, they have written quite a lot here but then again uh, one word that she had mentioned is I'm going to do the right thing and let uh, uh, and let the dice fall where it may be and I'm going to hope that maybe these politicians even if they're funded by mining mon uh, money must have the love for God their country and in their hearts so thanks so much uh, Gina because you have been an inspiration to us and you will be definitely missed